Nakota and I today are switching houses with Bailey and Asa. Where is the pink? We are gonna spend the night at their house, so switching houses with them. We gotta figure out what we're having for dinner. Cool Whip Bone Broth. Definitely going to the store. We'll see how this goes. We're gonna, we gotta go pack our bags and get ready to go. And I wanna give a huge shout out to Resident Home for sponsoring this video. Obviously, we're swapping houses for the night. So that means I had to go pack an overnight bag. I'm about to be so real with y'all for a second. This is what my closet currently looks like. It needs to be cleaned. Not my problem, because it can be Brooklyn's problem. I have my makeup in here already and my computer. Oh, hi, Chester. But I do need pajamas. This one will do just fine. Pajamas, trick. Don't mind the drilling upstairs. <laughs> we have someone hanging a TV for us right now. Throw me your stuff, babe. Oh. I guess by the time we're posting this video, y'all will already know that new products for oh, yeah. ITA. Contacts, so I can see my moisturizer, deodorant, toothbrush, a couple others. Which we can paste. Cleanser in the shower. Ta da! The end. You're too tall. <laughs> Let's go! Our home for the night, Just AKA kidding. Brooklyn and Dakota's so home. Ready to give me your house for the night? Yeah, I'm kind of sad because it's so clean. I know, I was like, dang, it's clean. <laughs> oh no. Just kidding, my house is okay. It's, except for my closet. I left a nice little gift for you oh. to do tonight. Oh, yeah, you think I'm cleaning your closet in this video? <laughs> One can dream. Let me tell you the list of things you have to do before I leave. We got a new mattress. I Therefore, really, I would suggest really you decide. unroll it and put it on the bed and remake the bed. I have a guy coming. He's gonna come hang all of these. So you have to be here for him to hang them. And then, we just bought these new pillows to fill these pillowcases. And then, I got, I got, I got one I told them, I told them, our and closet. Then. We're all like pushing the chores off that we procrastinated <laughs> in the last okay. month. So part of what we decided came with the house was swapping dogs as well. Ace and I are actually fostering a dog mm -hmm. along with our two normal dogs, Jack Jack and Willow. So you all get three puppies for the night. Yay. And we get one. One! Bye! Bye! Whole house to ourselves. The house is ours. <laughs> oh, hi, Jack Jack, I will. All right, we made it to Bailey and Ace's house, and it's clean. As you guys saw, Brooklyn left a extensive chore list for mm. us to do. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna try and knock those out as quickly as possible. She mentioned something about a new mattress, and I wanna get that out and up and working so that we have somewhere to sleep tonight. <laughs> Gonna give it a good old flop test to see if I should be jealous of how soft this thing is. Oh my! Brooklyn, this is very soft. All right, so you guys know Bailey and Asa just moved into their house not too long ago, and they just got a brand new mattress. Of Freaking course. It's sweet. It's so soft. It's nice, but they did leave it for us to put on. We are obviously laying on the brand new mattress. Freaking nice. I'll just be chilling here the rest of the night. How's that? I won't even have to put it on the bed. <laughs> you sleep right there. This mattress is all memory foam, which is for comfort, and then also flexible foam for support. It's clearly high quality. They clearly use high quality like materials for their mattresses, and I am very jealous. Okay, give it a shot, babe. What do you think? Soft? Oh, that is so soft. I already know you're gonna sleep so well on this mattress. Oh, yeah. I, I'm because, literally falling asleep right now. No, literally, <laughs> this memory foam is gonna help relieve pressure on your shoulders, knees, and legs, which he lives for, guys. Oh. Normally, he puts a pillow under his legs. Not gonna have to do that today. Seriously, I can't even tell. There's literally no pressure on my hips or anything. And it's gonna keep your spine aligned or help, which is so good for you when you sleep, y'all. For everyone who's gonna ask, because I already know the comments are coming. This is the Dream Cloud mattress. The mattress itself is like a 14 inch mattress and it's made with seven layers of like comfort. 
so that literally every kind of person who sleeps can get a good night's sleep. I am a really hot sleeper and I love to stay cool. And that's one of the nice things about this mattress is it is made with like really nice materials like cashmere and it's made with this like airflow and breathability so that you can stay cold while you're sleeping which honestly is a sleigh because I need that and so does he. The best part about this whole thing and this actually being a nice mattress is that it's actually affordable, literally being like $359 for a twin size mattress, which if you're looking for high quality mattresses, that's a steal. I'll be linking the mattresses that we talk about in this video in the description. So if y'all are interested in getting yourself one, cause seriously, this is a nice mattress. Just check out the description box and the link in the description box below at the end of this video. So what do you think of the Nectar mattress, babe? I love it. <laughs> <laughs> We've literally just sat here for like 20 minutes with this mattress out because we can't stop laying on it, but we need to go put it on their actual bed. <laughs> Do a little snap transition. Mattress off versus yes. mattress on. <laughs> Ta-da! Beautiful. Okay, Dream Cloud has really competitive pricing and also you can finance it. But also one of the cool things is that you can sleep on the mattress for 365 days and then you can decide if it's like the mattress for you. And if you don't like it, you can get your money back. You can test the mattress out for literally a year. You approve it. You approve? Cloud. You approve yeah, the mattress, Chester? I'm kind of curious to see if Bailey, Bailey and I Hello, Dakota and I will get what? a better night's sleep on this mattress or our own mattress. We really like our mattress, but this one so far seems pretty nice. Made bed, brand new. We gotta figure out what we're having for dinner. I'm hungry. So we're gonna look in their fridge and see what they've got. Wow. What do they eat with their salad? Wow, onions? Cool Whip bone broth. Definitely going to the store. What we're gonna eat tonight. Chicken, what are you doing? Wine haystacks. Like whatever. That's a. Those are some big chicken breasts. Heck yeah, baby. I like my chicken. So we are literally sitting here, and the first step of cooking dinner is chopping up the chicken, and we literally can't find cutting boards to cutting save boards. our lives. Do they have any? Woo! We found the cutting board. Coda made a delicious. Wine dinner. Haystack. He's got his rice and his chicken. Now he's gonna pour the sauce over the top. And then, and then add some cheese. We've got mandarins to throw on top. Or the side. Yeah. Yum. Yum. Alright, cheers. So we have officially checked off one on the list. Now we have to go do some of the stuff. I can't even remember. She just named a bunch of things we Hang had to go upstairs. Pictures? I don't know. So we're gonna go upstairs and figure it out. Guess someone was supposed to come hang these, but Asa just got the text that they canceled. So we're off the hook. Oh yeah. Now I'm hangry. We're gonna be lazy and go get food. Where is the pink? Literally. I'm having pink withdrawals. This is the only thing saving me right now. Pink phone. Tragic. Too many neutrals. When we left our house, we had given Bailey and Asa a little bit of a list of things that we were gonna do tonight. And so we decided we could do them a favor, obviously in return. And they asked us to build this dog gate thing. Coda finally figured it out. And all I did was really stand there and hold the gate for him. So Dakota's the champion of the night. Finally made it to dinner. Uh -huh. We're super hungry. Mm -hmm. Time to eat. We are finally fed and a lot less hangry. We are obviously exhausted, so we're gonna get ready for bed in not our bathroom. Nope, which we're is going super into weird. Bathroom. I'm just now realizing I packed a pajama shirt and forgot shorts. I'm about to raid Brooklyn's closet. Did I miss the PJ drawer? Where are your pajamas? I found a pajama bin, a random pair of shorts. Good to go. All right, Ace and I always do these cheesy transitions. Ready, set, ta da! Oh. They're in Bailey's bathroom. Dakota pointed out earlier. So the kitchen's pink, the living room is pink. So naturally, the bathroom, the bathroom is pink. You can see like, pink, pink, pink. Even the hand soap everything is pink. pink. Even our towels, every towel we see in this bathroom is pink. We are ready to go to bed using said pink towels. Dakota's gonna give you his routine right now. First off, I like my milk the phone. Washing my face. After my face is clean, I do my nightly serum. <laughs> I like to put it on my uh, forehead and my cheeks. And then rub it in. Once you get it rubbed in, I cream. 
so we usually we put it under each eye and my forehead. And then my deep moisturizer, deep rich. No, it's just deep moisturizer, rich cream. And that is my skincare routine. So sometimes I use the triacetone and sometimes I use the blemish. These four are my daily routine. That's because they're also my daily routine. No, you copy <laughs> Other than me. the blemish mist. You copy Someone me. Someone copy my nighttime routine. No. Everyone compliment Asa on his nighttime bag. Ta-da! I got it for him because he used to use this like super like, basically trashy a Ziploc bag. No, it was tragic, you guys. It was actually tragic. Let the skincare time lapse begin. Clean face. So nice. Skincare routine check. check. I feel weird not sleeping in my own bed. Like the plus thing is we have a nice, really nice mattress bed. to sleep on. Yeah, that's true. This is a very cozy. But we're going to bed because it's late and we're old people now and we go to bed before midnight. <laughs> Whatever, it's like almost midnight. So we're gonna head to bed and we will see y'all in the morning. It is like 11 o'clock. Probably 11.30, almost midnight, honestly. This bed is and so this comfortable. And this mattress is nice. <laughs> We're gonna go to bed. Yep, see you in the morning. 3.26 a.m. Friday morning, and Jack-Jack here just came and laid on my stomach, and I think that's... Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's his way of telling me he needs to go potty. Go, go outside, go potty. We are not used to this. <laughs> And the sleep through the night, it's totally fine. Uh. Good morning, everyone. So I think it's like nine something in the morning and we're finally waking up and we're gonna go get our morning started. Good morning. Good morning. <sighs> the way I just yawned, literally on camera, that was real, by the way, guys. Mm. We both slept like babies Seriously. last night. It's like a, almost like an Airbnb. Your hair. Oh, oh my gosh, your hair is tragic. Censored. <laughs> LOL. This is what happens every time I wake up. Time to make bed. I'm sorry. This pillow makes me laugh. Floppy little sad pillow. Okay, comment down below. Are you a fluffy pillow person, soppy pillow person, or a no pillow person? Because I'm a no pillow person. Now obviously I put my outfit on for the day. Bag is packed. We're gonna clean up the house and head home. Time to do our morning routine, which consists of skincare and Flattening brushing my teeth hair. <laughs> and putting on clothes that I just realized I did not even bring. So. Bed, head, and everything. We are packing up to go home to my house. We are fully giving after sleepover energy right now. Like, you just put on whatever you're just wearing. put it on and go. And leave. Time to go home. We are saying goodbye to Bailey and Ace's house and getting home to ours. We are actually very excited, I think, to see our house. We left it very clean, so I'm like, Hopefully it's still just as clean, because otherwise Bailey and Ace are gonna get a dogging too. So we're excited to see our puppy, and we're excited to see our house. Woo, home sweet home. We made it back in. Boy, do we love our house. I will say that their house was nice and I got a phenomenal night's sleep. Thank you, Bailey and Asa. Yeah. All right, we're home. This is the end of the video. Thanks for watching, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Comment down below if we should do something like this again. I know we also have to do like house tours, basically, of our decor, so maybe that'll be coming soon, too. Coming soon. We'll see y'all next week. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you so much to Resident Home for sponsoring this video.